The thing is, see, I want to do this conversation with you both as NATO supporters. And, and in okay. fact, you know, I, I want, I'm going to wind down and you guys will be able to talk all you want. Get into well, wait, the are, topic we, are we having are I'm we gonna sorry. have an actual discussion or is yes, it we're be gonna have an actual discussion that's structured as I see fit. That's okay, but then like I think I think this. we can like walk through point to point. We don't have to be like, well he's okay, pro so Ukraine, the first so he's thing pro that we're gonna talk to about kill Ukrainians. The first uh, thing that we're gonna this. talk about, and if I have to mute you because you keep interrupting, I'll mute you. Why don't you talk about that, laser pig? I'd love to hear your thoughts on it. Well, I love the fact that we're not even half an hour into this discussion and you're already trying to force this black and white fallacy on us. Part of that 16,000 dead includes actual Russian troops on the ground. Oh, and really? Yes, of course. They call, it a, they call it a... What, do you want to see the bodies? This is to, uh, me trying to preach. find out if NATO supporters, such as both of you, are <clears throat> ignorant or evil. Define evil. The opposite of the good. Define good. The opposite of evil. Okay. I'm not really sure where to go with that. I have These are problem. internet blood sports rules, Destiny. The, the, the guy the, who the thing is, is the guy who loses. Okay, the well, thing is, it looks like I'm the loser here. I think stepping into this call made me a loser, so... <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, my dude. I can't stand that! I can't stand that! I've got to get out! Um, good I luck, think, I mean, uh, don't I mean, get I killed, have... you know? It just shows that you are basically all about, um... destroying Ukraine. Your Destiny chickened thing. out. You know, he raged like a has... little bitch. Well, Destiny has left, and to be honest, I don't blame him. You're not acting civil. I am I'm acting civil, civil, but I'm calling out why you're going to kill your lives. Lives. Don't raise your voice at me, young man. Oh, what are you going to do? Squeal some more? Yeah, I'm a pig. Oink, I bitch. Know. Oh, buddy. I knew that this was going to devolve into this. <laughs> And Could you be. claiming that it's Russian propaganda doesn't change the fact that it's true. But it is Russian propaganda. So what? The station at Yavorov. Honey, 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 was, please. Don't call me honey. honey, piggy. Please. Piggy? I mean, if Cuba decides to join the Chinese military alliance and install nuclear weapons on Cuban soil aimed at the United States, that should be no problem whatsoever, right? What has that got to do with anything? Just because I look at a forest and can't identify a You're looking tree, at the forest and you're missing the trees. The trees. We're going to move on when you have answered the question. Alright, give me a second. I'm disappointed in Destiny. I thought he was made of sterner stuff. But I guess, you know, the blue hair must have fried his brains. Or maybe it fried his balls. Issues, and you have denied them <laughs> even though there's available evidence. And laughing hysterically, and rather nervously, I might add, isn't going to change That's not me laughing that. hysterically. Laughing is that, that me going, <laughs> it's just my normal fucking laugh, because I'm a weird sideshow freak. Laughing hysterically, we'd be going, <laughs> That's laughing hysterically. Uh huh. So, is the first statement true or false? What kind of tree would you be? <sighs> okay. Well, I, I saw the podcast for you two together. I, I will honestly admit, I have never seen two men in the throes of passion down each other's throats more than the last time I was at the Las Vegas so I would to insinuate like homosexuality between myself and Destiny it's kind of trivial you know no, so but it doesn't it really get a terrible out. to that Ukraine has managed to retake 70% of the land is it true that, that you live in uh, in your mother's basement uh, let me check mother <laughs> mother I require your assistance come here at once I'm out of Cheetos! No answer. Amazing. I'm so a professional. I'm, I'm a snotsman. So you can't intimidate me with such weak ass arguments. Come at okay. me with something stronger! I'm being told by my own chat to calm down because apparently the sexual tension between us is getting through the roof. 
Why do you keep bringing up the sex thing? Is that the only thing that you have, or is that a crutch that you use when you know that you're losing the argument? How expensive is food in Moscow? Is there food in Moscow? So what kind of tree would you be? I don't know. I don't know enough about trees to be able to give an intelligent opinion. Because I always remember uh, uh, George Bernard Shaw's quip, you know, never get down in the, in the mud to wrestle with the pig, because you'll only get dirty and the pig will enjoy it. And well, it's mm. in your name. So I decided to be prepared and I put myself, you know, in a nice little plastic proof, mud proof suit. I need, to, I need to ask, do you generally think, think that I'm you're a pig? an actual pig? But that's do you think I'm an actual pig? Yeah. Right. If my avatar was, if I was Laser Llama, would that make you feel more secure? No, I'd still consider you a pig. Right. But I was three spot. blocks away. I was literally three blocks away from the presidential palace in Kiev. I can say unequivocally that that's just bullshit. He wasn't at the presidential palace, though. I don't need to have been there to have known. Oh, come on. Bradley's are basically a, 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 lightly, a lightly armored Jeep. It's, it's, you know, better to have a Hummer. At least it's quicker than a Bradley. Come on. Yes, because you're a small failure of a man who never accomplished <laughs> anything in his life except his little giggling. And so you get a hard on by being on the side of the bullies, by being on the side of the despicable bullying tactics of NATO and that whole cabal. And you love it. That's the fact about you. You're a nihilist and you're always going to be on the side of the bully because ultimately your soul is black. You care about Ukraine? Yes. So do you want to join me in singing the Ukrainian national anthem then? I wouldn't be able to pronounce it properly and I have a horrible singing voice. So well, you are in favor of prolonging the war Do not know the words Ukraine? to the Ukrainian national anthem? No, because I don't speak Ukrainian. You don't like speak I... Ukrainian. You no. don't immerse yourself in the culture of Ukraine. No, because I'm, so... I'm stupid with languages. What do you want me to say? Can you sing it? Can you say it in English? No. You can't even sing it in English. No. Okay. Uh, just because I don't know that, uh, just because I can't sing a song, doesn't mean I mean like. It's uh, not a know, song. It's a national anthem. And I'm going to be ending this conversation because we've gone on for an hour and forty-five minutes. And okay. further conversation with you, I think, is I think we pretty much agree is a waste of both of our time. But right. I'm just going to say, I mean, I, I think I've made it very clear. But just to reiterate. I think that you're a piece of shit. I think you're a warmongering bastard who enjoys the suffering of the Ukraine nation and the Ukraine people. I'm That's Scottish. Honey, you. I'm Scottish. Okay. Now I'm going to bid you goodbye. Okay. Fucking you bye. die. Die painfully, I hope. Uh, by the way, Chad is asking you're gay, right? Yes. Is that, so, is that, is that, the collective West has become isolated from the rest of the world while Russia has improved its relations.